Yo, what's going on you guys? Drum Machine Addicts is back again with another highly requested tutorial and today we are going to show you a trick that allows you to merge your programs. So, and often in a lot of cases, you'll have one or two programs loaded. One may be full of 808 drums, the other one may be full of completely snares or whatever, right? And you might hate having to navigate between track one and track two just to get to the programs. There's actually a really simple fix for this. So to kind of show you what we have below, let's look at the first program I have loaded up called 808. Now, these are some of the drums I have loaded. All right, now using my MPC, I'm gonna navigate to track two. As you can see, track two is completely unused, but if you look at the left of the screen, you'll see 808 is the program we're using. But I'm gonna switch that. Now I'm using 604 Loft Drive. Sounds like this. All right, and notice there are only 14 sounds. The last two pads are missing sounds, right? If we go back to 808 program, You'll notice that we have those three pads filled on bank two or bank B as it's called but there are no other sounds in this program so it's a whole lot of empty space and it's a lot of work to have to cycle between two tracks so in order to save time and to save space and to save computer memory I'm gonna merge these programs you might be wondering how to do that so let's go ahead and get to it first we're gonna go up to edit Then we're going to cycle all the way down to program. Then we're going to go to merge. The screen's going to pop up and it's going to ask you what programs do you want to merge. In this case, we're merging 808 into 604 Loft Drive. And then we have start the next bank clicked. So essentially, once it runs out of pads on pad bank B or pad bank C it'll keep going to that until it fills up all the way through H so we're gonna press OK or excuse me do it all right and as you can see it merged our program so just to take a look and see how that went so that's all that's all 604 loft but now if we look We cycle far enough and get to pad bank D and we see that 808 is in there as well. All the sounds too. Now just for safety, let's go ahead and go to E. And as you can see, all of our samples and all of our pads made it. It's a little bit different than what I'm normally used to having them that far back, but I merged the program so what can you expect? And that's pretty much it, you guys. If you have any questions about merging programs, feel free to hit us up at drummachineaddicts at gmail.com. And don't forget to tell a friend to tell a friend to subscribe. We'll see you all next week. Peace.